2023 Ford Mustang Convertible Review, All Good Things Come to an End. The current Ford Mustang Convertible has been with us for nine years now, and it has proudly upheld the traditions of the famed American pony car. Sadly, it hasn't had a growling V8 in a while, but the turbocharged EcoBoost four-cylinder has done a great job powering the car with up to 330 horsepower and 350 pound-foot of torque. This has proved to be more than enough for a thrilling driving experience. It also handily outmuscles the base Chevy Camaro convertible, its closest rival in terms of pricing and performance. Of course, to keep that price down, Ford has not endowed the 2023 Mustang convertible with a whole lot of features, and since attention is focused almost completely on the upcoming 7th gen model next year, no work has been done on the current model. Still, it remains a top-notch choice and if you are a fan, now might be your last chance to get an unused one for your collection. 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible Changes, What's the Difference vs the 2022 Mustang Convertible? The new Ford Mustang Convertible is essentially the same car it was last year, minus two color choices for the exterior, Cyber Orange and Britney Blue. Pros and Cons Enjoyable driving experience more passenger space than most sports cars. High levels of practicality. Very competitively priced. No V8 soundtrack. Interior quality could be better. Coupe has the handling edge. About to be replaced. What's the price of the 2023 Ford Mustang convertible? The price of the 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible in the USA begins at $33,270 for the base model, increasing to $38,295 for the premium. Those are MSRPs and do not include a destination charge of $1,395 or any options. 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible Handling and Driving Impressions our review of the current Ford Mustang Convertible has always highlighted the driving experience, and while the drop-top may not be quite as capable as the regular fastback, it still manages to impress. Unlike some muscle cars, the Mustang puts a lot of focus on road comfort since it is meant to be driven daily and enjoyed to the fullest. The convertible really leans into this premise, with only large bumps in the road upsetting the ride. It is also easy to maneuver at low speeds thanks to the responsive steering. But once you start testing its performance chops, the steering gains some heft and the chassis tightens up. However, the lack of a solid roof is noticeable, and there isn't the same sense of confidence you'll get from the fixed roof model. If you're sure of yourself, though, you can push the car a little harder without fear, as it provides excellent grip. Be careful though as the crisp and accurate turn into a corner can quickly see the rear flying out when you apply the throttle. Still, a set of powerful brakes should put your mind at ease when it comes to bringing the Mustang convertible to a stop. When driven in a slightly more relaxed manner, there isn't much to complain about. For a more exciting experience, we do recommend the performance package with its superior chassis tuning and more powerful turbo 4 engine verdict, is the 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible a good car? The 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible may not be a spectacular performer, but it acquits itself remarkably well considering its age. It isn't the sportiest due to the structural sacrifices it makes in the name of style and leisure. However, the true value of a sports car lies in how it feels to drive, and this is where the Mustang drop top shines. It may be a little more laid back than the rest of the range, but that is part of its charm, and it combines really well with a ride that is more comfortable than you'd expect from a sports car. The four-cylinder engine provides decent acceleration and efficiency, and we can't fault the Mustang's looks, either, though the material choices could be a little better. That would push up the price, though, so it's something we're willing to accept, plus it offers far better practicality than most roadsters, which can only accommodate a small bag or two. The only thing that might dissuade us from strongly recommending the Mustang Convertible is the fact that a brand new one is right around the corner. What 2023 Ford Mustang Convertible model should I buy? Our one main gripe with the Mustang Convertible is that the interior just doesn't feel up to scratch. 
that can be easily remedied by opting for the premium EcoBoost trim, which upgrades the upholstery and adds a few nice-to-have features, including dual-zone climate control and a more up-to-date infotainment system. It can be upgraded further, but that pushes the price past $40,000, which we feel most people shopping in this particular segment may find that unacceptable. However, we do recommend sticking with the automatic transmission. It's important to remember that the soft top is not quite as athletic as the coupe, and the best way to enjoy its more laid-back character is with a slightly less hands-on approach. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.